Welcome to Teaching Practice, Fundamentals of the 5E Model, specially designed for primary and secondary school teachers. This course will help you understand what the 5E instructional model is, how it promotes active learning, and how it differs from a teacher-centered pedagogical approach. After completing this course, you will know how to design and deliver engaging lessons using the 5E instructional model. You will learn to encourage students to independently explore, reflect upon, and discuss a new concept. You will learn to only provide formal explanations when students have started internalizing the concept. You will be able to guide students to apply the concept to new contexts. Finally, you will learn evaluation methods that not only assess concept acquisition by learners, but also enable them to evaluate their own learning. In short, this course will help you move from a teacher-centered instructional approach to a more student-centered one. As a result, you will help your students build essential 21st century skills such as critical thinking, problem solving, creativity, effective communication, collaboration, and research. This course contains seven modules. The first module provides an overview of the 5E model and its phases. It also discusses strategies to implement effective pedagogical techniques in the classroom. The second module discusses the engage phase and emphasizes the importance of activating students' prior knowledge when introducing new concepts. The third module discusses learning activities that allow students to explore new concepts by making predictions, testing ideas, and drawing inferences. This is followed by the fourth module, which focuses on the explain phase. It examines the role of teachers and students in explaining new concepts or ideas. It discusses various learning activities that can help students draw conclusions, find patterns, and give explanations. The fifth module illustrates the purpose of the elaborate phase and recommends activities that allow students to transfer the knowledge and skills acquired into solving problems in different contexts. Evaluation, the final phase of the 5E model, is addressed in the sixth module. Through this, you will explore different types of assessments and learn when and how to use them in the 5E learning cycle. The final module, planning a 5E lesson, explains how a 5E lesson plan differs from a traditional lesson plan and what you should keep in mind while designing a 5E lesson. In each module, you will see an introductory video that will give you an overview of that module. This is followed by a series of seven to 10 minute videos featuring key concepts and strategies. LUMS faculty members have also shared their valuable in-class experiences and practices through one-on-one -on -one interviews. After watching the videos, your learning will be evaluated through games and assessment questions. Finally, you will get a variety of learning resources, including journal articles, lesson examples, and a list of references to read, analyze, and dive deeper into a specific topic.